Hi students, in today's class I am going to teach you the conversion of 1 bromopropane to 2 bromopropane. Okay. First of all, how to approach these kind of uh, problems? See, propane means there will be 3 carbons and in the 1 position. So, in the 1 position there will be a bromine, right? So, the rest of the valency you have to satisfy with hydrogen okay so this is your one bromopropane and what is your two bromopropane uh, students so here in the two position there will be a bromine there will be a bromine so if you analyze in between uh, these two uh, uh, molecules see the bromine is in one position and it is in the two position so how to shift how to shift the bromine in one position to the two position so what we have to do is we have to remove this bromine but can we remove bromine alone so it is not possible so what we have to do we have to remove hbr okay so we are going to remove bromine as br minus so hbr from the adjacent carbon atom has also has to be removed so so this process we are uh, we have named as what you know this rea uh, know this reaction right removal of minus hbr removal of hbr is what it is elimination it is what elimination okay so this is your this is your alpha carbon and this is your beta carbon right so for elimination what reagent will you use so kindly recall so you have to use alcoholic koh alcoholic koh or alcoholic naoh okay so please remember if you put alcoholic koh so you can eliminate elimination reaction will take place so how it will how it will happen students see so this is your ch3 ch2 and uh, this is your what this is your ch2 br ch2 br so for um, for uh, for you to recognize i am writing this okay one of the hydrogen like this so we have to remove this we have to remove this there is only beta only one beta hydrogen okay so when you add alcoholic voh so this two will be removed if you remove this this single bond will become double bond okay so you will get the product ch3 okay ch double bond ch2 okay now what you have to do is again add hbr again add hbr okay so if you add if you add hbr okay in presence of so hbr itself is an acid so we don't need any other uh, catalyst here so uh, what reaction it is it is an addition reaction in a during addition reaction what rule we have to follow we have to follow markovnikov's rule what markovnikov's rule says what markovnikov's rule says if you add any reagent the nucleophile part of the reagent what is the nucleophile part of this reagent is b Br minus the nucleophile part of this reagent will go to the carbon will go to the carbon which is having less number of hydrogen which is having less number of hydrogen here this one okay the nucleophilic part of the reagent will go to the carbon which is having less number of hydrogen okay so the nucleophile part will get add will get add to this to this carbon to this carbon and your hydrogen will add to this carbon okay so now you have got your 2 bromopropane 2 bromopropane okay students see if you add hbr so one more thing i am giving you uh, if you add hbr in presence of any peroxide if you add hbr in presence of any peroxide what will have happen you will get anti markovnikov's product anti markov Nikov's Nikov's product what is anti Markovnikov's product the nucleophilic part okay it is a radical uh, reaction actually so the bromine will get attached to the carbon which is having more number just opposite to the Markovnikov's product just opposite to the Markovnikov's product so kindly remember this okay so this is for your uh, additional information and how to do this so you have to remove you have to do the elimination using alcoholic KOH kindly remember not aqueous KOH alcoholic KOH followed by elimination add HBR it you will get the Markovnikov's product you will get the Markovnikov's product okay I hope this video helped you okay meet you again in my next video thank you